Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you want to see how I achieved this quick little style, keep watching. So I started off with freshly washed hair and I start off by parting the hair. So I normally wear my hair um to the side. Like I always wear that part of my hair to the side. So I thought it'd be easier if I split it to the side and then down the middle. This way I could kind of have almost the same amount of hair on each side except for that top part. And then by the way, I did wash day before this um, video. This is going to be my protective style for the week. And yeah. So now I'm going to section the parts that I just kind of made apart. Um, so that each side can stay separate. And then now I can start moisturizing my hair before I start my protective style for the week. I start off with the Myall Organics Avocado Hair Milk. This stuff, like I said before in my previous videos, is so moisturizing. It makes my hair so soft and just feels super good. As you can see, my curls are already popping as soon as I put it on. Just work it in. Then I use the Myall Organics Mint Almond Oil which smells super minty and it just really seals in the moisture when I mix it with the um, the avocado hair milk. Now I put that in a clip and then I'm going to finish moisturizing the top part of my hair because I'm going to um, twist this part up first. Now this is my first time doing this type of protective style. I normally, if I was to do a style like this, it'd be the goddess braid, but I don't know. I just felt like trying a different twist or whatever. And I wanted to use my new product that I got from um, the Quintessentials Natural Hair Tour. My parts are never straight. Here is the Shea Moisture Braid Up Conditioning Gel that I just got. Um, I'm going to try to get, I'm going to try to use this next time when I get like box braids or whatever. Um, to see how it works. I think it's definitely strictly for braids and those type of protective styles. Not for protective styles like this because I noticed that it gets really sticky and clumps my curls together. Which kind of made it a little hard to brush, as you can see. So, like, I should have used, like, an eco styler or something. Um, but it's okay. Trial and error is fine. Definitely not, like, an edge control type gel. So, after I put on my, my organics um, edge control... I brush it up so it can be nice and smooth and slick and then I already twisted that side up so now I'm going to twist the other side up. I did the exact same thing on this side as I did on the other side and here's the method that I use. I literally just take the hair and twist, 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 twist. Depending on your hair type it's a lot easier to use bobby pins or um, those little rubber bands. So to lay down my edges, I just used an old do-rag that I had. Um, and I didn't tie it. I did tie it super tight at first, but I had to take it down and retie it because it was giving me a headache. So yay, I'm taking it down. And as you can see, my edges are laid, y'all. They are laid. Um, now I'm just fixing the bobby pin because it came up. My hair is still wet, though. And there we have it. There's the side. I really hope you guys enjoyed this quick little protective style that I'm going to keep in for the entire week. Um, stay tuned for my next videos. Bye. You take Wednesday, Thursday, then just send him.